I really like to use parchment paper, especially if I'm roasting or I'm um, baking. It just keeps the pan clean. I can reuse it when I'm baking. There's a million reasons why it's good. I have a lot of trouble with the uh, rolls of parchment paper. Sometimes if you're in a hurry and you tear them, they don't tear evenly. You pull them off the roll and they're in a, they're like all rolled up and you've got to unroll them and it's just a hassle. So I thought I would try these from the Dollar Tree. There's 25 sheets, 15 inches by 10 and three quarters. And um, this is what it looks like. This is what it, this is the size. Um, another thing I like is because they're folded in there, you pull them up and they don't curl up. They're just in, um, they're just ready to go. In terms of how they fit on a cookie sheet, this is a Dollar Tree cookie sheet and it's a, a little bit big. There's a little bit of a, um, a lip on these, but you know what? I like that, especially if I'm doing sugar cookies or something that can spill over or if I'm roasting something that's uh, kind of liquidy. Uh, roasting some chicken bones here for a chicken bone broth a little while ago and used the parchment paper. And as you can see, the lip was really handy. The uh, chicken fat liquefied and it stayed in the pan because that lip was there. So anyway, I'm giving up on my uh, parchment paper rolls. I'm going to keep a, a roll on hand in case I have a, a large pan that needs to be lined. But for a general everyday use, I, I will be sticking to these. They're marvelous and I can highly recommend them. So grab a one or two when you're at Dollar Tree, especially if you like to bake or, or do messy things on the pan and let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching.